Hello everyone, my name is Rick Simpson and I am now recognized by many as being the leader of the movement to see that the cannabis plant is once again legalized. Uh, actually it's not about legalization. What we need, we need these laws to be repealed completely and thrown in a trash can because these laws are all based in corruption. Recently I was just contacted from some people in the US about a lady named Shauna Banda. Now I've known Shauna for quite a few years and uh, this lady was dying from Crohn's. She was on her deathbed and she used this oil from the cannabis hemp plant to save her life. Now I can't say that I could look at that as being a crime but it seems that in many states in the US it still looked at that way. Uh, recently her child or her son was in school and apparently they were having some kind of uh, conversation in the classroom about cannabis and her son got up and told the classroom the truth and I from what I understand a, sh a short time later Child and Family Services came and took her children and right now basically Sean is kind of hiding out until you know we see what's going to happen here but you know this is so ridiculous because the US government themselves since 2003 have had a medicinal patent on this plant that they say has no medicinal values at all. Now this is utter foolishness. You know, I mean the American government have known about the Medical School of Virginia study that was held or that was done in 1974-1975. They, they've known the effectiveness of this oil in the treatment of cancer and many other diseases. And that's the reason the American government put these patents in place. That's how ridiculous this whole thing is. But I want people in the U.S. to understand that, you know, when you go to court, if you're picked to be on a jury, in any of these cases concerning, you know, the dreaded marijuana plant, you have the right to, you know, to jury nullification. In other words, you can find the person not guilty. And I would strongly suggest that people start doing this because they're trying to put people in jail that are simply medicinal users. And this is beyond foolish. You know, people like Shauna shouldn't be, you know, have to go through, you know, this kind of uh, horrible experience. This is insanity in, in all levels. So I'm hoping that people in the future, you know, if you could pick for a jury, for God's sakes, listen to what they have to say, you know, listen to the case. But, I mean, if this person, the person that has been charged, if they have a legitimate reason at all for using cannabis, for God's sakes, find them not guilty. What are they guilty of? Using man's oldest known and safest medication. A, a, some, a plant that's been used in medicine for 5,000 years. You know, to me, this does not even make any sense. So I'm asking everyone, if they can, to, you know, to support Shauna, uh, to, to support Shauna, and if possible, if you have some extra money, you know, support her with your funding. You know, this lady needs all the help she can get. And, you know, believe me, if you're in the situation when you're being attacked by your own government, and that's exactly the situation she's in, then you, would, you too would want all the support you can get. So I hope you will support Shauna, and let's bring an end to this madness. I mean, we all know what this plant can do. One country after another is legalizing its medicinal use. Oh, you know, you go on the internet, you see all of these YouTube videos about how effective this medicine is in the treatment of practically all diseases, but yet these corrupted governments think they have the right to keep this medicine from us. I think it's just about time that we showed them otherwise. Thank you very much for your time.